This will do. Thank you, Eivor. Anything to help you feel at home. I am most at home helping others. May we return to the subject of your visions? We could, if you think it worth something. I need one more ingredient to finish an elixir for you. Look around the pond there. You will find what I require. Once brewed, this elixir will help you dive deeper into your visions, to see them more clearly. Don't sting me. If the bees bother you, boy, maybe do not stand so close to their hive. But I need honey. Just a little. It's for my friend. It's all she likes to eat. She's so gentle and kind, but if she doesn't get her honey, I don't know what will happen. My friend loves honey. She has a very sweet tooth. I only want to scrobble a little. They have plenty to share. I've tried poking it with a stick, but it riots them up something chronic. I 
I only want to scrobble a little. They have plenty to share. She's so gentle and kind, but if she doesn't get her honey, I don't know what will happen. it with a stick but it riots them up something chronic <laughs> mm. my friend loves honey she has a very sweet tooth it with a stick but it riots them up something chronic my friend loves honey she has a very sweet tooth she's so gentle and kind but if she doesn't get her honey I don't know what will happen We want to scrobble a little. They have plenty to share. I've tried poking it with a stick, but it riots them up something chronic. My friend loves honey. She has a very sweet... You got the honey? Oh, thank you. Oh, that looks delicious. Leave it on that rock and she'll be right along. the tree. Hurry before she comes. with me. She'll be here soon. Winifred looked after me ever since mother and father died. She's my best friend. The other children tease me. Sometimes they throw stones to shoo me away and call me the grubby watcher in the woods. Winifred saved my life. I was curled up on the grass praying that God would take me too. And she scared the wolves away. There you are, Winifred! I got you honey! <sighs> Winifred, my bestest of bears. Any day spent with you is my favorite day. So today is my new favorite day. This kind stranger got you some honey. What do we say? Thank you. All that honey must have given you quite a thirst. Are you really all right out here on your own, little one? Silly. I'm not alone with the very best of bears by my side. 
Goodbye. And um, thank you. Come on, Winifred. Shall we walk to the lake? Maybe we can splash in the reeds. <laughs> Please don't hurt my friend. They're all I have. A strange fellowship. And friendship can often be found in unexpected places. Must be careful now. Have my grass. Do you see soon enough?
Baldur's Bay, overrun by flame. Now my dreams pursue me waking. Yeah. No more winters for you. Bitter to die than face my lords. I hope my Magister Magnus forgives me. For so long I looked to him for guidance, for order. If your honor is slow, a true lord cannot forgive you. They cannot. <laughs> now I will turn my gaze to Warden, Tiwar, and Shunor. I will continue to turn until I find some forgiveness. You will spin and drill yourself to an endless bottom. Let's go hooded here.
So, no one to lead us. No hand upon the helm. Alfred will choose a new. Shall we drink the place dry, friend? Drink it down faster than me. You are the victor. Let's see your silver. Make it interesting. Ha <laughs> For gold and glory. Let's drink. Ha ha ha. Let's drink. You think you can drink? Prove it! See my wares. Nothing else? I'll see you later, friend.
ut congregentur ad Marcus et vixit ad Pulgares de terra superbus est lo venite audite ver... Heret lumbare ad furure de hominis Singulos vir. Dixa ad eos rapscaios andreas dominus nostra, fensit ad dominus nostra sapiens lupus, vide collectas cupra in terra a terres, et locustus est ad eom et precipit rex somnium. Peribit. Venite odoremus et ade talata mero. Who will lose? 
These are strange things you tell me, Matilda the Seer. Show me. Oh, these are strange things you tell me, Matilda the Seer. Strange things indeed. Who is that man talking to? Matilda. Pig sees the future. Loki's twisted threats. What trick is this? None. You drink, Pig speaks. What? Hello, Pig? What are you saying? Pig? The Red Sparrow will settle in the cuckoo's nest? I, uh, I don't feel anything. Are you a talking pig? I, Matilda the Seer, lift the veil. Shall I show you what is to come, Raven? Beneath the sacred city where panthers prowl, you will find what stole the maiden's blush and begin the final journey. That pig. Where did you get such a surprising creature? Mark it. And... is that all you have to say? Pig speaks enough for both of us. In water, iron then shall float... as easy as a wooden boat? Iron? Uh, what madness do you spout, devil? Who are you? A seeker? A wanderer? A killer? Woman or man? <sighs> You wear a magician's cloak and speak to ravens. Whatever was in that room, it was powerful and mind-twisting. <laughs> I must drink more to get clear. Yes, your words, pig. Yeah. That is such a strange word. Is that a word?
Nekwesape, Malalek. Good day. What is your name? I am Eivor, of the Raven Clan. And are you a flighter? When the mood strikes, do you wish to flight with me? Oh, no, certainly not. I don't engage in such things. Haven't a head for it. My brother, however, he is quite proficient. Ah, then you wish to compete with me. I should mention, my brother has taken a strict vow of silence. If you wish to flight, I will translate and relay his verses. I think I understand. Good. Hark! To those gathered round, wave your hands and rejoice! I shall trounce this poor fool without use of my voice. Such is his challenge. Do you wish to face him? I'll happily challenge you. Sorry, him. Here you are, my bet. Good. Now remember, it is not me you are flighting. I am but a conduit for his words. I will keep this well in mind. Good. He is ready. Come you closer, friend Eivor, and lend me your ear. The most cutting of flights from my mouth you'll not hear. But by proxy I'll call you a milksop and boor. You are afflicted with terrible arrogance, but perhaps I am the cure. Your body is withered, your garments absurd. I'll topple you over with nary a word. I'm devoted to flights, though to silence avowed. Though you choose to be quiet, your folly is loud. Oh my! Your visage is ghastly. I'm cowed by your stink. I should like to write more, but you're not worth the ink. So, a last parting phrase. You're as dim as they come. With such drivel to speak, I see why you keep mum. Very fine work. As an impartial observer, I must say you won. Thank you. My brother has a few parting words. You have bested me squarely and thus won the day. So take what you've earned now and hurry away. I will. Farewell to you both.
Stretch your wings, Sunan. Una. Kinning is Thomas. Venite a Torello Stefano. to die! <laughs> Going to smash you! <laughs> Dominus out from the fundamentum alpha to liquidia domino. Signatra unis pia et pi sunt simula natura. Said ic quod est naturae nisis Deus manifestat arbitrarium. Hey! 
can't do this alone. 